hello everyone welcome back to my channel my name is tolu nazal if you're here for the first time you're welcome and if you're my returning subscriber thank you for coming back again today i'm taking you to banana island in ikoyi lagos nigeria i'm going to be showing you a part of banana island that i didn't show you in my previous video it happens to be close to where the collapsed building happened and i'm also going to add clips of the viral video also please watch to the end i'm going to add something too so if this is what you like to see sit relax and enjoy this video please do me a favor watch it to the end We are turning into Banana Island Road. The estate is just about a kilometer ahead. There are so many developments here and so many estates. Many buildings are under construction and you have many more to come. Olori Mojisola Onikoyi Estate to my right. If you're getting any value from my videos, please hit that like button and subscribe, please. Thank you so much. Marion Apartments Welcome to Banana Island Visitors access code will need to be confirmed and properly verified before you are allowed in including that of pedestrians Security here is very tight. They also have 24 hours patrol in the estate. Welcome to Banana Island Residential Zone. No siren, no honking, no learner drivers, obey traffic signs and speed limits, which is 50 km per hour. You have the estate shuttle for ease of movement. Banana Island is an artificial island that got its name because it's shaped somewhat like a banana. It's under the Etiosa local government area and it's regarded as one of the most expensive neighborhoods in Nigeria. It's a mixed use development and it's home to some of the most influential billionaires in this country. It's a well-planned and organized development and security here is very tight. Please stay with me. I'm taking you to First Avenue and it's the vicinity that the collapsed seven-story building happened. But before that, let me just drive through this area a bit and then we'll make a U-turn. It's a very clean environment with good road network. The road is wide, interlocked and in good condition. There are so many trees here.
It's a very serene and quiet environment. You can count the number of people you see on the sidewalk while moving. There are so many people with houses here but live in the diaspora. Sometimes this environment appears lonely. Houses here have very high fence which increases the privacy of the owner. I have done an extensive video of this place. I'm going to take you to the area that I didn't touch the last time because it started raining when I came here. If you would like to know more about this place, please watch my past video on Banana Island. I'm going to put a card for it after this video. I'm taking you to the mixed use area and that is where we saw that viral video of the collapsed building. However, my video was recorded before that happened. So please keep watching. This looks good. A lot of houses here are really big. There are some undeveloped spaces here. A three bedroom apartment in this place could go between 300 million naira and 750 million naira. It's really an expensive neighborhood. There are waste baskets by the sidewalk and this helps to keep this place clean. It's really clean. If you're interested in getting your properties in Lagos, please reach out to me. My number is on your screen. What do you think about Banana Island? Please put it down in the comments section. I would love to hear from you. For a full video of what this place looks like, don't forget to check out my past video on this place. It's going to be linked. We're taking a ride to First Avenue and the speed here is 35 kilometers per hour. We are in the mixed development zone. This is 106 close. There are many developments here as well. One o seven close to my right, and one o four to the left. The next close to my left is 102 and that is where the 7th story building collapsed on the 12th of April 2023. Thank God a lot of people were rescued alive and we would hear one speak now. from the seven day king collapsed building inside banana Island. and I, I'm, I'm just i'm not just among outside or inside the compound i'm on top the seventh floor when it happened so at that 
same moment, when the thing started, I don't know what to do, I don't know what to do, where to run to. I only ask myself, God, did you, uh, did you reveal this thing to me in dream? This, is this how I'm going to die? I'm, I'm just like, I, I give everything up to God. But last, I found myself at the ground without anything standing to my body, without any wound. So I'm here to give back glory to God. I say glory be to God. Thank Lord. Shout hallelujah. God delivered him. We are out of Banana Island and back to the Banana Island Road. If you haven't subscribed, please click on the subscribe button. Don't forget to give my video a like, please. This place is green and beautiful. I'm just going to let you see the rest of this vicinity before the video ends. Thank you for watching. Thank you for staying with me. Bye and see you in my next one. Click here to watch the next video.